The first thing you have to know is yourself, your strengths and your weaknesses. The second thing you need to know is your prospect and what is most important to them. Once you know those answers, you build your presentation accordingly. Some salespeople work with predetermined or memorized presentations. The problem with this kind of presentation is it sounds canned or robotic. I'm sure you've gotten these just as you sat down for dinner. The salesperson sounds like they're reading a script off a computer screen because that's exactly what they're doing, reading a script off a computer screen. Why do they do this? A canned presentation ensures that inexperienced salespeople cover their key points of their presentation. The disadvantage, reading a script off a computer screen demonstrates a general lack of knowledge, sincerity and passion in their delivery. In the approach and appointment sections, we emphasize the importance of using an outline. That holds for presentations as well. You'll want an outline to steer you and the prospect through your presentation. We'll talk more about presentation tools later, but realize that all the data you gathered in the approach and appointment sections goes a long way towards filling in your presentation outline. Now, based upon their responses to your question, you've uncovered your prospect's problems and needs. Use your outline to ensure that you're communicating the right message to your prospect at the right time.